Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 93 cubed plus 44 cubed divided by 93 cubed plus 49 cubed. So we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. But here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem. We will show all of the working here. So the very first step we are going to do is here first uh, we will uh, we, we need uh, some substitution here so we take uh, uh, this 44 equals to a and we take this 49 equals to b okay and you see here if we will add a and b then we will get here a plus b equals to 44 plus 49 equals to 93 so we substitute 93 44 and 49 equals to a b and a plus b uh, so uh, our above expression is written as this is 93 equals to a plus b because this is 93 cubed we write a plus b cubed 44 equals to a and uh, this is 44 cubed equals to a cubed it is divided by uh, this is 93 and over 93 equals to a plus b cubed and plus 49 equals to b cubed so here after this step we need uh, the cubic formula you know that if we have x cubed plus y cubed it is equals to x plus y times of x square minus xy plus y square so here we can apply this nice uh, cubic formula so that our above expression uh, is written as here you have this is our x and this is our y so we write it as uh, first we have x plus y here our x is a plus b and our y is a into x square over x is a plus b whole square minus x y into y is over a cubed so we write it here uh, y is over a and plus this is y square so y is over a square and this whole term is divided by this is again we have a cubed plus b cubed we, uh, we can apply uh, this formula again in the denominator term uh, so uh, this expression is written as uh, first we have uh, our again our x is a plus b and our y is b so it will be written as uh, a plus b and plus b into uh, here we have uh, x square our x is a plus b whole square and minus x y again our x is a plus b and y is b in this case and plus y square y is b square Okay, so here uh, we need uh, some simplifications uh, in order to simplify the terms uh, and now you see here first we add or subtract the like terms so we have this is a plus a equals to 2a plus b into here we have this is a plus b whole square and here we will multiply this a on both of these terms and it will be written as a uh, minus a square minus a b and plus this is our a square and it is divided by uh, here we have a and plus b plus b equals to 2b and here we have uh, this is a plus b whole square and we multiply this b on both of these terms and it will be written as minus a b plus b square and this is over plus b square when you multiply this negative sign on these two values it will be again equals to minus b square okay so here you focus on the numerator and denominator term you see that this plus and minus term are cancelled by each other this is plus positive and negative term are cancelled out by each other and we will get here 2a plus b times of uh, a plus b whole square minus a b divided by again we have this is a plus 2 b into uh, first we have a plus b whole square minus a b okay so now in the next step here we need to back substitute the values of a and b uh, 
Uh, so uh, uh, first you see that these two values are same so these complete values cancelled out by this whole value and we get the remaining values are 2a plus b divided by a plus 2b and now here we need to back substitute the values of a and b so uh, in the start of the problem we have our a equals to 44 and b equals to 49 so when you put it these values here it will be written as 2 times of a and our a is 44 plus b is 49 divided by again our a is 44 plus 2 times of b is 49. So here we need uh, more simplifications and now here when you multiply 44 times of 2 it is equals to 88 plus 49 divided by this is 42 plus here when you multiply 2 times of 49 it is equals to 98 so because we write our uh, given algebraic expression into the simplified form so uh, here when you add 88 plus 49 uh, so it is equals to 137 divided by uh, similarly when you uh, sum up uh, 42 plus 98 it is equals to 140 okay so this is the our final simplified form of the given algebraic expression this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.